My name is Jimmy Lee Keith. I live in Shirts, Texas. I've been a truck driver off and on for 30, 30 35 years till I had my problem, my diabetes, and then uh, I lost my leg. With our specialty, we obviously see uh, patients that suffer with uh, diabetes and the other major illnesses that cause uh, hardening of the arteries. And unfortunately, uh, one of the bad results is major amputations. Uh, through the years, we've seen a great problem with patients being able to acquire prosthetics because of either no insurance or their insurance does not cover prosthetics. It was not uncommon to see patients uh, wheelchair bound uh, for years just because they were not able to obtain a prosthetic leg. I have Medicaid and Medicaid won't help me. Uh, I don't know why. I've been on Medicaid for many years now. If you don't have Medicare, um, the Medicaid patients uh, are usually not funded for prosthetics. The actual cost for an above the knee prosthetic is $5,000 and for below the knee uh, $3,500. I'm 64 years old. I just can't do what I used to do without my leg. I try a lot, but it's, it's hard. Um, I want to do everything that I used to do. I want to be able to get back outside with my grandchildren, get down on the floor and play with them, but I just can't do it with, you know, in this chair. Uh, there's no question, when you lose your mobility, it affects the whole body. Uh, if, if you're not able to get around and walk, Obviously, it affects the, the cardiovascular system, your heart, your lungs, um, and uh, just being wheelchair bound uh, also causes a tremendous uh, problem with uh, wounds, pressure wounds uh, around the sacrum, around the buttock areas. Decubiti, as we, we call them, decubiti ulcers, they're, they're very painful, uh, they're very hard to heal, um, they require major surgery. and. Again, some patients um, end up uh, dying from the complications from these large wounds. I just like to get out of this old chair and do stuff that I, stuff I used to do. And I know I can if I do, if I do get my leg back. I know I can do that because I've been working my hind end off to get myself in shape. As a member of the prosthetic board, uh, I and my other uh, representatives appeal for your support for this great cause in helping these individuals uh, res restore their life. We know that there's no question that once they're able to walk again and be mobile, that this increases their self-esteem, their self-worth, and improves the quality of their life. And not only does it affect their personal life, but their family and the community as a whole. I would love anything in the world to have have my life.